guess who's back in the house? Mm. Guess who's back in the house? Uh, it's that beatbox. Oh, okay. Guess who's back in the house? <laughs> What's up? Welcome to the official essay chart show. My name is Yolom Gonyama and you are... Litu Kata. It's been a minute since we've introduced ourselves, don't you think? It's been a long time. And we probably have new subscribers and watchers oh, and yeah. likers right now. Actually. So it's good. It's important yeah. that they know how to pronounce the names they see right here on the bottom of the screen. Welcome to the official essay chart show. Your chart show that has the most streamed songs weekly. We bring it to you live from the horse's mouth. Undiluted, untouched, unedited, no filter. These are the official top 10 tracks that have been the most streamed in the land. No debate. If you are on this chart, you are official. You're good. You're good. Can't nobody argue with you. Mm -hmm. Know what I'm saying? Absolutely right. not. Are you ready to get to the top 10? 100%. Let's uh, get it. Let's go. At number 10, we have Calvin Momo Babalo and with Soka Suka Gude. Mm. I mean, last week they were number six, number seven. Gooby. And now they're number 10. I mean, that Gubi. means there's some, there's some new people in the, there's in the charts this there's week. Movement. So I'm quite excited no? to see that. Mm. But for now, let's check it out. <laughs> That's a very nice song, Kelvin Momo. I must start uh -huh. listening to that so that yeah. now means of a who, of Utio Moholo. Because, you know, <laughs> apparently, you know, he's for the grown and sexy, and that's what it is. Anyway, at number nine, we have Ulwan Lunkulu with Nyeza, which is a brand new entry and the first this year so far to debut in the top ten. So that means you guys are very, very keen on this song. And so, Chef's Kiss, and congratulations to you, Lua. Let's check it out. And at number eight, from number one to number four to number six, and today to number eight, because mm. of all they are coming through saying Sila. Sila. The song that says Sila. <laughs> okay, anyway, um, it is KO with Siete. Man, 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 in other thing. In a bounce, you know. You listen to Sete, and I feel like robbing a bank to spoil my people. But you know, don't do it. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you think you always got me there, don't you, Popo? <laughs> we were just joking. <laughs> <laughs> got <he. laughs> No self snitching over here. <laughs> Is it me or you? It was you, number seven. All right. So at number seven, we have Amos and Amufaku with Ifatela, which seems to be a track that is very consistent on people's playlist. Hence the longevity on the top ten charts, and I think it's well deserved. So let's check it out. Please hold my arms. And at number six, we have Maestro Sham Music, Fifty Years with. Don't do it. Don't. I'm trying. Don't. You okay, see what let's you did? Go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You see what you stop listening to this track right now. <laughs> We just want to do one solid link without her wanting to do this thing. Tobeta, check it out. And in our bubbling under feature this week is a track that, you know, I... I, I don't know how to say this without starting a fight. Because mm -hmm. where these two names are involved, whatever you say about them, there's beef. But... This is a track that I personally expected to be in the top 10. Mm -hmm. um, shocked that it's still bubbling under, and that is AKA and Kulichana with Prada.
Ah, uh, yes, man, and we are halfway through. At number five, we have 2.1, Stimela, featuring Tatesana and Tabi Sings. I will not say anything about the names this week. You know what you did. <laughs> you know what you did. <laughs> and at number four, we have Big Nas, which seems to be a group that, um, unfortunately, we should say, seems to be like a hot rod of controversy and the people surrounding them. And this week, Twitter and the socials generally took exception with Babes Wotumo using her late husband's socials. Still, people are mad at her. What are your thoughts? Like, should she? I don't know. Like, I, I, I don't, is she mourning? Is this how we we mourn differently? We do. Absolutely, but, we do. But I would say let mm. him rest. But then again, I've never gone through what she's going through, so I can not really say. What do you think? Why don't you let us know? What are your thoughts on the whole Babes Wotumo using Mampincha's social still? Um, do drop us a comment. I'm very curious about this one. But for now, let us please enjoy number four. Big Nas coming through with Nye. Alrighty, now while we're at it, I think it's about time we check out the street savvy since we already have some news going on on the top ten. Street savvy for you guys. Welcome to another installment of Street Savvy, your weekly dose of umkosi. And you know, we know that you hate waiting, so let's get straight into it. And our first story sees us picking up yet another South African artist whose name is crossing international waters and flying the SA flag high through Amapiano. American rapper B.I.A. co-signed our good sis, Bobby Cooper, on her socials, bigging the Amapiano sensation up. And rightly so, I mean, because you know Bobby don't play. She don't play. At all. Yeah, man, she don't play for sure. Mm -hmm. So, the first episode of a TV show that has long since been rumored has finally aired. Love and Hip Hop South Africa, episode one, gave us a look at some of our faves' love situation things. And let's just say, I didn't quite hit the right mark. Well, yeah. that's according to a large number of Twitter users who commented on the premiere episode under the official hashtag. My question is to this. Are the stars themselves boring people with boring love lives? Or is it how we show, how the show is formatted, yeah, rather? Yeah, yeah. I mean, be very clear, please, because lives are at stake right now. You know what I mean? You can't just be saying, hey, love and hip hop, and it's got some of our favorites. You must be specific. Who is boring? Tell us. But also, it is compared to the American one. You know, that one is fire. Every episode, you are bound to see some things flying left, right, and center. So. I understand. Let's I understand. just say it's the show yeah, for safety. For now. And it's quite important when yeah. producers take shows from America and they want to adapt them to South Africans, they check the culture first. Because Facts. love and hip hop in South Africa, it's amazing. But the culture mm -hmm. is not the same as American culture. I don't know what you think. Speak. You guys let us know right down here. But I know one show that I would be part of though. What's that? Love is Blind. Please. <laughs> Any producer who's watching tell this, us, bring it to us, South Tell us more. Tell I'm us ready, more. I'm ready to meet my love, the love of my life, who I'm going to marry in, who I would marry in 10 days. Mamela, I love is blind is the one where you meet someone for the first time on the date. So you meet them and they on the opposite side of the room, but you don't see them. All you do is just connect emotionally. I think I have an idea for our next show. That was Street <laughs> Savvy. Thank you very much for joining us this week. We will be catching you next time. we love. Or rather music. And it is February. Knowledge. Happy oh. Love Month, everybody. Bye. At number three, we have Matrix Mashu do Mina Nawe featuring Happy Jasmine and Emotions DJ. Guys, there's nothing wrong with using your, your IT names, your government. I'm just, from time to time, it becomes, you know, just catch us off guard. But yeah, Mina Nawe. It's a good song. I'm not fighting. I'm not fighting. I'm not fighting. Okay. So crazy, so crazy, so crazy, so crazy. And 
at number two is everybody's favorite Niger boy at the moment, Rima, with Calm Down, a song that seems to be going absolutely nowhere. Check it out. Once again, we have her at number one. It is Miley Cyrus with Flowers. Yeah. What do you think of the song? Yeah, yeah it could be good. Mm. It could be. What is it about? Flowers. Flowers. But yeah, congratulations. You are number one, Miss Miley Cyrus. And we tip our hats to Shout you. Out to you. Mm -hmm. But anyway, that is the show for the week. Thank you for joining us. It is always a pleasure. Please do not forget to tell your friends, your mom, your uncle, or a body to pull up and check us out every Thursday at 12 p.m. It has been an absolute pleasure. But good seeing you again. Peace out. I didn't wanna fight, started to cry, but then remembered I